Today is another day for you to see something amazing when it comes to China innovation. So get ready to see some of the most amazing technological advancement and super engineering marvels you can only find in China. Hey, how's it going everyone? Arthur is back with something amazing to show you. So don't forget to subscribe and ring the notification bell so that you don't miss any of our great contents. And so without further ado, here we go. Number 1 is China's ZQ-2 Carrier Rocket Completes Assembly. Landspace, a private Chinese rocket company, has announced that they recently completed the assembly of the first level engine of the ZQ-2 liquid propellant carrier rocket. The first level engine of ZQ-2 is composed of four 80-ton thrust liquid oxygen methane TQ-12 engines providing a takeoff thrust of 268 tons, and it will soon be tested for its capacity and performance. The 49.5 meter ZQ-2, which is independently developed by Landspace, has been scheduled to be launched for the first time. With a diameter of 3.35 meters, the launcher has a lift-off thrust of 268 tons. Number 2 is China's ZQ-2 carrier rocket completes payload fairing separation test. A Chinese private rocket company has completed the payload fairing separation test of its ZQ-2 launcher, laying a foundation for its maiden flight. The fairing has a diameter of 3.35 meters and a total length of 8.24 meters. The ZQ-2 liquid propellant rocket has a total length of 49.5 meters. The commercial launch vehicle has a lift-off thrust of 268 tons and lift-off mass of 216 tons. Number 3 is China Ready's Massive Antenna. Asia's largest single aperture, fully steerable antenna is ready to go into service to communicate with the Tianwen-1 Mars mission deployed by China. The antenna in Tianjin City in northern China has a diameter of 70 meters. It covers some 4,560 square meters, an area about the size of 10 basketball courts. Chinese officials said that the dish will help collect data from the Tianwen-1 Mars probe when it enters orbit around the Red Planet. Number 4 is China's first third-generation nuclear reactor. The first reactor adopting China's third-generation nuclear reactor technology has been put into commercial operation, announced China National Nuclear Corporation in Beijing. The opening of the reactor Fuqing No. 5 nuclear power unit indicates that China is now the one of the leading countries in nuclear power technology. Number 5 is Key Tube Installation for Mega Undersea Tunnel Project.
a key part of tube insulation for an undersea tunnel mega project was completed in the Guangdong, Hong Kong, Macau, Greater Bay Area. The undersea tunnel, a huge transport link between the cities of Shenzhen and Zhongshan, will be the widest of its kind in the world once completed. Designed to be an 8-lane bidirectional expressway with a total length of some 24 kilometers. Number 6 is 100,000 ton deep water oil facility arrives in South China's Hainan. A 100,000 metric ton deep water semi submersible oil production and storage facility named Deep Sea No. 1 arrived at the gas field of South China's island province of Hainan. The facility will be used in a major deep water gas field for an annual supply of 3 billion cubic meters of gas to Guangdong, Hainan, Hong Kong, and other regions. Number 7 is new light rail train rolls up assembly line in northeast China. A new light rail train has rolled off the assembly line in the northeastern Chinese city of Changchun. It boasts a combination of high speed and low maintenance costs. It was developed and manufactured by Chinese train maker CRRC Changchun Railway Vehicles Company. It has six units and a maximum speed of 140 km per hour. It'll be used in the eastern Chinese city of Yiwu, connecting it to nearby cities. Number 8 is one-year countdown of 2022 Winter Olympic Games. All 12 sports venues for the 2022 Winter Olympics have completed construction. Preparations are also undergoing at Beijing's Water Cube sports venue. The iconic Summer Games Arena will be transformed into an ice cube for the upcoming Winter Games. And that concludes this video for today. Once again, this is Arthur. Thanks for watching and have a wonderful day.